understand the the um severity of having to provide for your family and be able to <laughs> she said she put you in the corner again come on. <laughs> <laughs> Commute is my time out person. She gonna put you in that corner and watch. Um, but I understand. I understand that. I understand the severity of having to provide for your family and how hard and difficult it must be. But we are gonna provide and pray that God. We are gonna ask God to provide a way for you. That way you can. Take that he can release the load off of you or take the load off of you and provide you with Substance. some, yeah, some type of, uh, of uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Mm -hmm. uh, provide you with what you need. Right. And, and that's the thing. <laughs> this is me, I got to put you over my lap. <laughs> I can't. No, no, I'm weak. Be nice. I'm just saying. Um, so yeah, let's go into uh -huh. come on, sir. Yeah, but you trying to multitask all the time. I am trying to multitask. All right. But well, we have to go. We do? Because yeah. I think people are loving it. I know they love us. They love us. They really love us. And we love y'all too. And put you over my lap and thank you. Um, I'm just saying. And then put them in a the <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they just seem up for me here. All right. I can't wait till, till some guys actually join the pod zone. And be like, damn, just right. Okay now. Uh -huh. Okay. We love you too, Tip. We really do. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. And Camille, we love you too. Both of you. We love you, love you, love you. Come on, sir. Yes, ma'am. Multitasking for no reason. No, ma'am. I'm not multitasking for no reason. I'm actually doing it. All right. Anyway, like I was saying, 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 like I I mean, I hope we said something because, you know, I study your preachers, study your pastors, see if they have a word for you or not. That's number one. Right. We will still outnumber the men. Hey. Yeah, all right. What are you just, talking about? What were you just saying? Uh -huh. I, need my, I need my women to help me gang up on you. I'm weak. Because I, I, it's hard. I got two of them I, to I, deal with I, every day, all the time. Uh, I'm weak. So we will so see if you appreciate preaching the word for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What yeah. else? What did you learn from this series? I learned that I <laughs> well, I learned that when they don't got a word, <laughs> that they go praise. <laughs> they go praise break every time. I I I, I kid you for not. a long period of time. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I kid you I, not. <laughs> watch watch it. I've been in church a long time. I, I think I've seen it. I think I've seen it all. I think. Le I've learned that I have to watch my preacher, watch the, watch my my pastor carefully and learn them, as well as under um, figure out whether or not they're preaching the the word and the word is being extradized. Is that the word? Being extradized properly. And that I'm also confirming the word. <clears throat> it's not just about them giving me something and me not going back and redoing my research. Oh, if they give you a scripture, definitely um, go um, back, and, go back and dig in, deep dive in, yeah, yeah, and yeah. do your research. And then that way you can bring it back to them and be like, uh-uh, sir, you was either wrong or sir, I love you preaching. Um, because Or sir, can you explain or what can you, you explain? Preach? Because I don't fully understand it. Right, because I went, I did that one time and it was my first time ever doing it because I didn't understand it. Right. And I was scared. Um, and the reason why I was scared was because it wasn't because I didn't know what he was not particularly what he was saying, but because I was trying to understand because he was a pastor, he would not he would have never understood. Or because he's a pastor, you don't. And and that's another thing that irritates me a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. I'm not saying don't submit under your pastor, 
but I don't like it when people go like you can't challenge your pastor on the word or on something on on some type of poll because that that you just have to just you have to just you just have up. to eat the vomit that they spew out and just be okay with that. I I, I that irritates me. I can I cannot understand that. In a sense, because you won't fall too, sir. You you had fallen in some shape, form, or capacity. And you could fall based off of certain things being feeling that power and that getting to your head, and you want to be like, yeah, nah, um, mm -mm. if what you're preaching to me is a confirmation in the spirit, and they said try the spirit by the spirit. Mm -hmm. So my spirit gonna know if you doing or you saying the right thing. However, if you're not, then I'm gonna have to ask you, hey, pastor, so you were preaching the word here and this is what I understand and I got it, da, 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 da. Don't pray, don't be afraid to challenge and when I say it, I say it with all do with all yeah, not respect. all the time though. Because... Yeah, yeah, not not all the time, but I'm saying it with all respect of just wanting clarity. Especially if you things. don't know what they were talking about, or you felt like they were off. Right, because at the end of the day, if they're truly a good pastor and a good leader, they would understand that they need to take time to break down what they have even uh absorbed through the holy spirit and be able to pour and give and don't go to the members because the members will will protect their pastor just as much as the pastor try to protect themselves right go <laughs> straight to the source the one that said it and be like oh this is what you said this is what you said bah, hey bah, can bah, you bah, clarify bah. for me because i don't i don't understand it <clears throat> or oh, this is what i gathered while you were is, is this something that I can hold on to? Or is it something that I could dish away? At the end of the day, like, look at how many people have poured and give money to pastors and leaders and this and that and the other. And, and they all oh, worshiping this pastor, like this pastor could never do any wrong. And come to find out the pastor was buying house care on your own dime was doing a bunch of manipulative stuff. And when it comes out into the open and it's being exposed, now you as a member feeling doltish and stupid because, oh, no, that's not my pastor. But they're humans too. Yeah, they may be humans. Um, and I think we could go right into your agree to disagree because I'm glad you brought that up. Um, they may be human, but at the, at the end of the day, um... This is how you know I ain't doing my homework. I forgot my agree to disagree question. Ah, uh, well. Um, if you would like, stay right there. If you would like to sell, it can be a dollar, five dollars, two dollars, three dollars, whatever you desire. They will take um, as leader. Yeah. As leader. Right. Um, we offer this time now. If you would like to uh, just be a blessing, you can do so now. Um, the cash app at the bottom is dollar sign Jerry T25. Dollar sign J E R R Y T25. Wow, I did that without no problems and issues. Finally. Finally. You can do so now. Because our conference is coming up. So you yeah. don't want to. Uh, we are going uh -huh. ahead with our uh, the coming to um, conference. Where it is all things marital, single, divorce. If you're married, single, divorce. If you just anybody and everybody just want to come in and get poured into and just have a conversation, an open conversation about marriage and about how did you come into uh, uh, your making your decision to become married or to divorce or why are you. You know, being why single, you, still single? you know, why are you still single? What's your decision is? Because you never know. The, single want to get married, but they it's hard to find the right man. Right. It's the J and S Podzo is, is producing and producting 
a coming to conference in August. And we need um, uh, we need venues. We need we're going to ask for vendors. You know, we want to make this a big and uh, upcoming event where everybody can just come in and enjoy and sit down and laugh. There will be laughter. Y'all got this man over here. <laughs> you know when you got this man. The conference is in August. We're we're aiming for August. Um, if not, then we we'll, we we'll change it. But definitely, yeah, I want to put we're, it we're up. We're trying in to we're trying and aiming for August, and so we don't want anyone to miss this opportunity. We have so many things that we want to get done, um, and we want to do. Um, I have um, and am publishing my new book um my one did you even get the email and yet? only book no i haven't gotten the email yet um which is coming soon and it's called sing it say it with me um so i'm hoping that it'll everything will all be good um and it's just more of a journal a journaling um book that i also want to do a conference to link into but as of right now we know that we are working towards this conference, this coming to conference. It is I think going you, to be we could do this both. We could do both, Friday and Saturday. Right, Friday and Saturday. We are just we just need we need your help. We need your help. Um we are really just trying to make this the best, best, best conference. It is our first, very first conference at all. To be Actually, hosted. my second. Well, your second, but my very first to be hosted. Um, and so we take this time now. You would like to. Oh, don't worry about it. I think tickets are going to be on sale. So. All right. Look at you. Come on, Jesus. I think tickets. Give the vision. Sale. Write the vision and make it plain. And this is what we're doing. So, so either so, way. Um, it's so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We just don't have a, a specific day. I'm thinking or, the 24th. But we're going to come back to you with all this. I'm not a man of, right. um, of, of trying to, trying to, oh, Lord Jesus. I'm not a man of trying to, um, you know, figure everything out on the line. But, yes, we're trying to do it the 24th. And um, that's a Saturday, but definitely look it out, look up, look out for it. You never know when it's gonna come. So with that being said, um, you know, yeah. So the twenty fourth, I'm looking at, um, in August, right? Camille, you better come. You better come. You better show out. You better. Uh, I'm looking for you. I'm looking for Tiff. I'm looking for um, everybody, 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 everybody. Right. So I'm looking. I'm I'm looking for singles. I'm looking for divorce. I'm looking for because because people that are divorced want to get married again, even though the Bible says you're not really supposed to get married again. But but uh, that you're not it. The right. point of the matter is we want everybody to come on out. Right. Um. Which bring me to this. Agree to disagree. Agree. For our first time that don't know what this is, which I'm pretty sure everybody does already. Um, this is a part of the segment where I ask the question and we agree or we disagree. We with answer it. it. We answer it. And then we have 10 minutes on the clock. I thought we shortened it. Nope. God darn. 10 minutes on the clock. Um, that 10 minutes starts the 10 minutes starts when he asks the question um and then we just start answering it if we disagree to if we disagree on it we'll just say we disagree to we agree to disagree if we both agree on it we will clap like this that wasn't together that was together i'm just saying that was not together wait you actually did show it all right one two three Whatever, it still wasn't. Together. It was your timing is all one, two, three, clap. There we go. <laughs> yeah. All right, um, and so yeah, go ahead, sir, and ask your question so we can answer. We're always going over time. Let's go. All right, 
Oh, just give me a message. You come to and just to say I'm going to try. We hope you I do. Know. We hope you do. Uh, if not, send somebody. Free. Send somebody on your behalf. We accept those too. <laughs> <We> uh, <laughs> all right. So this is a good question because mm-hmm. I was thinking about this and mm-hmm. just and I, you know a lot of people smoke weed and I used <laughs> no, to hear I, I used to hear all the time. It. I used to hear a lot. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's not in the Bible that you. Know, oh well, no, I'm sorry. Is they used to say, um, God created the. The plant so we can smoke it, right? So, just because if it's not in the Bible, does that make it a sin? Go. That's a very good. If it's not in the Bible, does that Bible, make it a sin? That's a very good question. That is a very good question, but it's a very. Ooh, that's a very. Does it make it a sin if it's not in the Bible? Ooh. I think anything that goes against God or goes against what um well Tiffany said no I think anything that goes against God uh <laughs> will and purpose for our life is mm-hmm. a, in a sense okay. to me. that it doesn't bring God glory or pleasure mm-hmm. to me I think that's a sin okay. so I don't necessarily think that the Bible have to say don't smoke weed in order for us to know that <laughs> smoking weed is not okay Okay. So I, to me, just because it's not in the Bible does not mean that it's not a sin. I, I strongly believe that anything that goes against God is a sin. Period. So sin. like, if smoking, because smoking weed is technically not in the Bible, so that it is doesn't not a thing. have to be not in the Bible. So are you saying that? Yeah, smoking weed is a sin because yeah. it, even though it's not in the Bible. Yeah, because it goes against God. It goes against it goes against what God. Um, How do we know it go against God if God never said it? Oh, that's a good question. Or or is it not? Was it not? Burn, because I I'm burn bush. I'm, <laughs> I'm <laughs> not a burning bush. <laughs> not a burning bush. <laughs> not a burning bush. Because here's the thing, right? I think that if I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm naturally against smoking weed. I'm literally naturally against smoking weed. I do not like it at all. Jaden don't even like it. I was smoking at all, rather. But if you're talking about when it comes to the Bible and you're talking about, oh, what is not in the Bible? Oh, this is not in the Bible. So I'm able to do it. Just like the law. Oh, this is not in the law. This is why we have no yours because if it's not in the law, how they, how can they fight against it? How can the prosecutors fight against it? Because it's not a law. I'm going to come back to you. You're going to put me on the spot. I just truly believe that it doesn't have to be in the Bible in order for it not to, it, in order for it not to be a sin, or it, in order for it to be a sin. I think that anything that goes against God, that goes against God, and you know what is goes against God because God is going to reveal. The Holy Spirit is going to convict you of what you're doing that is wrong at he the makes- end of the day. So if the Holy Spirit, now I am playing, but medical we help your eyes. I don't believe none of it. Like, like we say that it's 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 bogus to me. That medical weed stuff is just a cover up. It it's a cover up, just like prostitution. It's a cover up. Prostitution is a cover up. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. They, they, does the Bible say that prostitution is a thing? Yes. Oh nice. <laughs> yes. Do you not hear about the prostitute? Uh, I'll be this year later. First of all, okay. there was a man in the Bible who got married to a prostitute. That's one. Two, was it a prostitute? It was a prostitute. A it was a prostitute. Who helped the, pe- the people? I don't know about that one. All right. So anyway, I know about the married the man with the prostitute. That's not the point. The point you was asking was it's, about weed. It's not a sin. No, I mean, I was saying anything. However, we, I, I just naturally hate weed. But I'm just saying anything. Does it, is it a sin for you to, for you to do something and it's not in the Bible? Because a lot of times we be, we, so, 
So that means if if we break the law or if we if we do something and it's not in the and and it's not in the bylaw, we can still go to jail. Yeah. Because it's not a sin. Help the it help the body. Nah, I don't believe it. Uh, I I just probably because I naturally hate weed, but you naturally hate smoking. I do. I already do. So you are probably God made the perfect. earth. And the trees and the flower and some weed. Yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> Camille, go now. You go in the corner. <laughs> now you go in the corner. <laughs> now you go in the corner. I'm making y'all think today. Y'all go in the corner now. You go in the corner, Camille. Don't say Camille in the corner. You're right. God created these things. But, but I, I'm, I'm making you think, bro. Right? It's not like I'm still in my the, head. The whole like, point. God, I, I, I'm talking to God. Like, <laughs> Father. Because we have we have this preachers that smoke weed. And it's stupid because it's like, yo, do y'all mm-hmm. really love God? Or y'all, why are y'all smoking? We have music. Every musician I know smoke weed. Literally. Every musician I know. And it's like, I mean, it are, are we good. really? It makes them goosey. So what about drinking? Because drinking get because according to some the people, said, paranoid. Don't be drunken. Don't 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 drink to the point of drunkenness. Uh, drunkenness. The fine. Bible definitely did say that. So. Fine. But what I'm saying is just because Tiffany said God created everything, but it's how we use it. Okay. Okay. I I, I could probably I still think I still believe that it, just because it's not in the Bible, if it goes against God and God and the Holy Spirit convicts you of what you're doing is wrong, then then it's a sin. Right. <laughs> that's that that that's my personal. So opinion. would you say that all right, I'm gonna go down the list. Baby, don't even go down the list. Weed, wrong or right. Sorry. Love you too. <laughs> wrong or right. Um what do y'all say, ladies? What do y'all say? I mean, we. I think we can still. He got said. Some he said. He said. We wrong, wrong or right? Just because weed is not in the Bible does not mean it's not a sin. Like that's just how I feel. But is, all right, wait, hold on, let's go. Is it right? So you saying right? Hold on, wait a minute. I, I, come on, I got more stuff. We got three minutes. Wait a minute, hold on. All right, so Tiffany she, said. Tiffany said right. Right. You can drink, but not get drunk. That's true. Right. So Tiffany say yes. Come here, what you say? We right or wrong? Baby, I'm asking you nah, real quick. Asking, you trying not to? I'm, you one of those preachers right now <laughs> trying to get down. I'm asking the audience. <laughs> Come on here now. We on a game show. <laughs> I'm asking the audience. You trying not to? You trying? You trying to get a chi out of this? No, I'm asking you one the of those audience. Come All on, right. Camille. I'll say wrong. Answer. I'll say wrong. Give me your answer, right or wrong? You she said. Probably- she said, she right. said right. All right, so I'll go. I'll go with the majority. <laughs> I I wrong it. It's wrong. It's wrong. All right, fine. Go ahead. What's, what um, up? Drinking, <laughs> right or wrong? Nah, that's wrong. Wait, 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 wait. I'm getting the audience. Guys, Baby. he said drinking. He said drinking. I said wrong. We got two minutes and 13 seconds left. Let's go. She said, don't go by what we say. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we, thank you. We sticking together. We girls stick together. All right, she said we set water into wine. <laughs> Tiffany's with it. I'm convinced. Tiffany's with it. You I would say no. I would say wrong. Yeah, I hate it. Uh, uh, like it's you THC. Just don't like it. I, I, Cause I, I promise you, people are going to start feeling the effects of weed. I'm, I promise you, it's going to happen. Camille says right. She so said right. right to All right. So you know. right to drink it. I, I, I say right because the only reason I'm saying right because you're not supposed to. The only reason why I, because the Bible does say mm-hmm. that you're not supposed to mm-hmm. um, get drunk, mm-hmm. but you could drink, mm-hmm. and wine is one of those things. Mm. But I, but me personally, I don't like it. It's whatever. I'm, Y'all see how he is? Um, he said wrong to weed, but right to drinking. Sex. No, sex before marriage. Ooh. Oh, come on. That's an easy one. How you going to say that? Listen, I was young one. <laughs> <laughs> this boy got 47 seconds. 
All right, wrong. Before we. <laughs> Check that to marriage. Yes. <laughs> oh, we. Tiffany said yes. You can drink. Yes, this and then get that's this. right. It's right. Okay. okay. So, so wrong to we. Wrong, for wrong to we for you. Right to we for us. Okay. Right to drink it for me and right to drink it for y'all. No, right to drink it for you and right to drink it for them and wrong for me. Oh, wrong for you. Okay. And then you got sex before marriage. Now, I feel like a hypocrite to say wrong for drinking because <laughs> I sure know you mind me a glass. Oh. And read that one again. All right. Okay. So right, right, right. Go ahead. All right. I'll change my And then sex before marriage. Sex before marriage. Wrong. And then you got, before we even go any further, agree or disagree? If it's a sin, if it's not in the Bible, does that make it a sin? <laughs> Can we just say that we just forfeit that? <laughs> <laughs> no. It. Like I'm still thinking you can about drink, it, but not get drunk. That's true. You can drink, but not. I, I, I'm still thinking about it. So can we just forfeit this one? Right, we forfeit it. We forfeit this one. Ooh. <laughs> oh, the pressure! <laughs> the pressure! Ooh, Jesus! Oh, I knew that was going to be a good one. That's I was thinking about pressure. it. <laughs> we forfeit this one. I know you. I'm what do y'all say? Anybody? I don't care who it is. What do y'all say? Well, if it's well, not in the Bible. Tiffany and them said that if it's not in the Bible, it's not a sin. If it's not in the Bible, then it's not a sin. All so, right. so it's not a sin. So it's not. Even a though sin, I feel like it is. Okay. Oh wait, no, we agreed because you feel like it's a sin too. All right, cool. Come on. Wait. Do you if, feel like it's a sin if it's not in the Bible? Is it a sin? That's forfeit. <laughs> forfeit. Because there's something that are not in the Bible that we do, but we may not. Because if you ever hear a prayer, some people would say, but um, if we don't know what we do, take it away. Right? That Some people say that in their prayer. Okay. Right? So we don't know if God is pleased with it. Pleased with it. We always would know what God would please with because the Spirit... Will always yeah, walk with the flesh, and yeah, the but, spirit will definitely let you know because you will be uneasy about. Yeah, but that's what where everybody's spirit is different. There's some people that you I may be too. like. There's some people you may be like, oh, um, I felt this by the Holy Spirit, and then 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 there's some people that be like, well, well, I was in the spirit. No, some people be like, you was in the flesh, and I'll be like, all right, well, so, we're gonna just forfeit this one. For sure, for sure. We that, that's question. a difficult question. This I'm still busting my brain. Anybody out there still busting <laughs> their brain? Because I'm I still talking to you, Jesus. I'm still talking. So Holy Spirit, keep on. Okay? Matter of fact, I'm shut my mouth. I'm listening. I'm listening this time. This time I'm listening. Anyway. If it's not in the if it's not in the Bible, is it the same? And I think that some people need to understand. And I, the reason why I bring this question up is mm -hmm. because some people don't understand or know that if what you not every Look time at that they they're rooting with you. Oh, thank you for the first time. Uh, <laughs> not every time you, you do something. Sometimes it is a sin. Sometimes it's not a sin. Sometimes people just just are stupid. Sometimes people are just um over yes, over um over, over serious. Oh, not over serious. <laughs> Yo, how could you be over, baby? Time for you now to be in a car and let's go. We ending. We Sometime are way people, over time. This is this is my critical moments. All right. <laughs> sometimes people are over serious, and sometimes we don't understand, or sometimes people don't understand rather when it is. Oh, all right, smoking weed, for example, or drinking, or having sex before marriage. I mean, that's fornication. That was the easy one. I don't know how you didn't get that right away. I was a child when yeah you know, but that don't mean book. that it wasn't wrong but i'm just saying that i was one of them ones before right but that don't mean all oh, right you can't say oh it, it's wrong it was i did it but it was wrong i did it too but it was wrong and, and that is what it is right i mean god forgave forgave right if god was, is a forgiving god he would forgive you right um you and up. you throw it up sorry 
<laughs> but the point is that you know, Talk I think. No, no, I'm but I think the point is is a lot of times we have to understand having said after marriage, BDSM. Um, hey, is, hey, 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 hey! Watch it, watch it. That's not a sin. If you're married, it's not a sin. Okay. So that's the reason why I bring these things up because these are some of the things that's going to be talked about in the conference that I want to do. Ah, sir, um, I'm sorry. I need to know what I'm getting into when it comes to sex. Not he's growing. <laughs> <laughs> this is so funny. Um. Yeah, some people do, but me, I don't really care. I, I'm, I'm, I'm more of a laid back, freeway person. Uh, 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 me, I, uh, I don't care. Especially if you're my wife, and or, you know, uh. Um, whoever I was in, you or somebody else. Especially if you're white. Oh, okay. <laughs> you almost made me, you almost made me send you to Jesus real quick. I mean, Jesus he was gonna God. send you by him right back. Yeah, anyway. we. Yeah, what if, <laughs> we don't need him right here. Yeah, send me yet, but 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 she the, says the sex have to be good. I'm we, not the sex have to be good. Said, Come said, here, said, said, I'm we. I'm I, I'm just saying it do um, it gotta be it gotta be good. I'm weak. But the point is right. We so so this is something to think about. If you whoever is listening, whoever is listening, Tiff, Camille, whoever is on, um, um, Apostle, um, I think Hannah was on at one point. Um, we have to know if. What we're doing at all times is if it's going to be sinful to, or if it's going to be sinful in our lives. Do I always believe everything is a sin? No, of course not. I don't believe everything is everything a sin. Everything is but I do sin. think and I do believe that whatever is against God and does not bring God glory, I am either idolizing it, which is a sin, or I am, uh, yeah. I'm idolizing it, and in, in that in that format, it cr it makes it a sin for me, in my eyes. That's how I see it. I don't see it like that, though. The only reason why is because, and we might go back to this, but the only reason why, because it was, and, and I just thought of it, but going to the movies, that's that's not bringing God glory. It's it's, it's actually doing nothing to God that says, hey. Let's go to the movies together on out on a date. Okay. Or go to out to. I can I can I can date. see your point there. I could I could definitely see your point there. So so we have to think about these things and understand and know and what brings you too right holy for no, no to that's the whole point. I'm glad you got it. I'm glad because I've been thinking about this question for two weeks now, and every single two weeks you weren't here. <laughs> And I almost forgot it until you said something. I was like, yes, Don't I got it. Don't be too holy that you are no earthly good. I understand that. So she said you move on. Tiff said you, a married person, and <laughs> the sex is bad. Then what? Yo, that's going to actually be in the next one. I ain't going to hold you. <laughs> Come on, that's test drive. Not test drive. That is actually going to be the next one. Yeah. <laughs> that is actually going to be the next one. I wait promise. A minute, you, I promise wait a minute. Wait that's a going minute. to be. That's going to be the next one. That's going to be the. That's next what one. I'm talking about. You got to test it out first. Yeah, but God said no more. That's it. You're right, but I mean, <laughs> you just still got to test it out, baby. You still got to make sure it can drive <laughs> and put it in park when you need, <laughs> baby. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm over. I'm over. Baby, we are so over time. No, because they got you. They got you going for part two now. <laughs> because that is so true. But 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 we're going to talk about all this. I promise. We're going to talk about all this next Sunday. I mean next Saturday. Next oh, we, Saturday. we might as well do it at four now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If y'all can tune in on four, we will change 
from be, being at three, and we will do it at four. The only reason I, right, because the only reason I did it at four today was because my wrestling was on. I didn't want right, he was like, uh, "We don't want to. I don't want to see y'all right now." No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna do it at. We're gonna try four to do it at four, so next gonna... week. And then the twenty fourth is my birthday. So yes. So guys. their birthday both him and Jaden so um I'm gonna need y'all to come and show some real good love to them okay you, you done you hear what I said no oh great he heard <laughs> look at his face he's like yeah I did <laughs> the 24th is their birthday um we want to have I want to have something to uh a nice little mini celebration so, um, I and we really, could do it right here at the house. We are. Oh, we are. Yes, oh. we are having the mini celebration. I am going to be cooking. Um, I'm going to be doing all things Jerry and Jaden, what they like. Um, so, guys, I've already invited a couple of people already. Um, at first, we were going to do it at Dave and Buster's, and it was really more for Jaden. Um, but we are. Because we want to save money and we want to save cert certain things. And their birthday is a Friday. Um, their birthday is a Friday. So um, if you guys could come on out and celebrate with them, don't come bare, uh, with your bare hands. Yeah. Come Me and Jaden love money. We love, we love money. Well, I don't know about Jaden loving money. Jaden well. loves money. Love, he, I mean, but bring, bring a gift. Bring a gift. Bring a gift. Right? Right, right, right. You guys I have guess. been such an amazing, amazing, amazing. Oh, you never know. We might be on that day. Um, so, I might be on at ten o'clock that day, if anything. Or, 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 I could do a specialty where we could do a specialty Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. We will be on at ten a.m. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Thursday. Oh yeah, you're right. I'm, I am. I'm oh. off. I was about to be like, why are you going to do that for? Sorry. I know but what I'm you. saying. I got you. That's why I'm the husband. Okay. That's why you got the husband. So, yeah. yeah. He said, okay, thank you. <laughs> Yo, I'm done. I'm done. But, yes. But we hope you win. <laughs> it says, uh, David Buster. Yeah, we were trying to do, uh, <laughs> Camille said, I'm bringing the weed. Not bringing the weed. <laughs> said, David Buster's. She also said, turn up with we. <laughs> he heard you. I know he did. Turn up. Um, oh, I said, happy birthday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The 24th of May. That You know, that's Memorial Weekend. So I know some people already have probably starting to have plans. But we're going to do something right here at the house. So come on through. I got the cake together. I'm not going to say no more. I got their theme together. I ain't going to say no more. But come through, definitely. Bring the weed. Uh, baby, we don't even smoke. Bring the edible. Baby, we don't even eat those. Bro, I eat. I don't know about eat those, but I eat. Anyway, like I was saying. I'm joking. We love you guys. We Thank you for you. joining. Thank you for Whoever staying Whoever joined. Well. We in an hour, almost two I Guys, almost like guys, I don't, we do it. I don't even stay on lives that long. I'd be like, oh, y'all going really to be trying, We really be trying to minimize it to an, an hour. hour. We really but do. it'd be so good. This be this be too good that we just can't. Not we cookies. We, right? Yo, you got Tiffany and Camille. Camille, Camille I, <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand. Not bring the week. I'm telling you, Pastor Camille. <laughs> 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 At this point, it's a wrap. <laughs> Turn your pants. No, no, no. We have fun. <laughs> I'm over serious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, go laugh. Come on, go be looking like he smoked for you too. Yeah. <laughs> How do you say that? Camille gonna be like, he smoked for you too. What are you gonna say? Guys, we are be cracking up. I cannot. No way. Stop. It's almost two hours. We've been all here just laughing and enjoying. And 
Laughter is good for the soul. Yes, so they say. Right, the pasty weed cookies. I'm pretty sure. Mm, be nice, Sharice. Las Vegas! WrestleMania will be we in Las Vegas. We're going to be in Las Vegas next year. Who's April, down? April 19th and 20th. Who's down? They were supposed to. They were supposed to um, announce it on the Kentucky Derby. They did. They did. Yeah, I missed it. Oh, oh well. Um, uh, let me say this. Let's close with this. <clears throat> that, um, in all that you go through and all that we go through, we want to put God first. Um, and in that, I'm with Tiffany. Let's pray. Let's just pray out. Yeah. yeah let's go. All right. Hi. Mm-hmm. He's invited to Tiff. So make sure bring them. Bring all the babies. Jaden's gonna love. <clears throat> gonna love them. Um, let's pray out. <clears throat> Come on, sir. Oh, you I prayed in. You pray out. Let's go. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come to you right now, God. Thank you for everything that you have done. Thank you for everything that was said on this pause on whether it was laughter or whether it was serious, God. God, we pray that you give us, um, we give we, you give us infinite wisdom, God. God, we pray that nothing that was said was not to your satisfaction, God. Yes. God, we pray whatever. If, if it's a sin, we pray that you take it away, God. If it's yes. if it's a mask that we wear, we pray that you take it away, God. God, we pray that if it's not in your will, we pray that you take it away, God. Amen. So, God, we pray that everything, every single thing, God, that is in your will, we will be able to accomplish. We will be able to do it, and we will be able to understand, God. God, we pray for these pastors, God. These pastors that have to go out tomorrow and preach your word. We pray that you give them hope. We pray that you give them power. We pray that you give them strength. And we pray that you give them the ability to understand your word, God. God, for they know, but not what they do, but they understand your word. And God, if they are sending behind the congregation back, we pray that you expose them to the to the to the sheep, God. We pray that they won't be able to understand what is going on, but they will be able to understand that there is. There is um, glory in your name, God, and you are not one to be played with. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Amen. First of all, you said we pray that they don't know wisdom, and then we pray that they do have wisdom. Something I don't even know why I said so that. Oh, okay. Something you said just now. Okay, when I pray, I don't even know why I'd be saying half of the song. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> but, but we pray for strength. No, I said you pray, we pray that you give us infinite wisdom. I don't know that part. That was the last part. Amen. Oh, no. I said something. All right. We are out. We are here. We are everywhere. We are JNS, and we will come to you next Saturday because we, as long as the bill keeps getting paid, we're going to be here, right? Right. So The bills are going to be paid. Your bill's going to be paid. Good, because you're going to pay it this week, right? I'm done. Bye. I'm cooking. I don't got no time with you. <laughs> Bye. See you. Okay. See you later. See you later. Bye, Tiff. Bye. Bye, Camille. Bye, everyone. We are here. We are here. We are here. Hit us up in the inbox. We're going to make a whole JNS podcast page. Yeah. Soon. So definitely, you want to look out for that. It's going to get bigger. It's going to get better. Right. (laughs) (laughs) I can't. Bye, Camille. We'll see you tomorrow, Camille. I'm Molly.